Alrighty guys, welcome back. Today we're currently back out here on Forza Horizon 5 today. And for today's video, I do have a brand new mind glitch going up straight into and share with you guys here today. Now with today's mind glitch, the rewards are actually very good and as well as the amount of time that it takes to get your rewards. So from this, you should be looking at anywhere from 320,000 credits to 530,000 credits, as well as anywhere from 60,000 XP to 90,000 XP. And you're also going to get two free wheel spins along with those rewards as well. And you can actually get all these rewards in under a minute. So overall, not bad rewards at all for the amount of time you're actually in today's money glitch. So we're going to go and hop straight into this and hope you guys do enjoy and find today's video helpful. Remember, if you guys do, leave a like as well as subscribe and turn on post notifications to stay up to date with more new videos such as this one or others similar to it. And with that, we're going to go and hop straight into this and hope you guys enjoy. But before we hop straight into today's mind glitch, if you guys don't want to sit around for hours grinding out these mind glitches, then you can head on over to MitchCactus.com and check out some of their instant delivery mod accounts, which can be applied to a personal account of yours, or you can just purchase a standalone credits and spin pack. They are by far the most highly reputable modders with 5,000 plus verified reviews on their official Trustpilot page. They offer packages for Xbox, PC, and Steam, ranging between 50 million to 999 million credits accounts. There will be a link in the pinned comment below as well as in the description. And be sure to use code DRAGSTER for 5% off your purchase. And now with all that out of the way, let's hop straight into today's mind glitch, and I hope you guys enjoy. Alright, so hopping straight into step number one of today's mind glitch, you guys are going to need a specific vehicle for this. Now the specific vehicle we're going to be looking for is going to be the 2014 Local Motors Rally Fighter right here. So you can pick up one of these cars for 100,000 credits in the auto show. And once you go and buy one of these cars, keep it 100% stock. Do not put any tune on it, nothing. Just keep it a rear-wheel drive stock model. So once you have one of these cars, the next place we're going to go is into the Creative Hub, then select the Event Lab, then select Event Blueprints. Now, from here, we're going to go and pull up our search bar. And right here where it says share code, we're going to go ahead and type in a specific share code. And that specific share code is going to be this one right here. 105825105. So we're going to go and find this blueprint. Make sure to favorite it so you can find it later. And then we're going to go ahead and enter a solo race event for this blueprint. Now when it asks you to select a vehicle, obviously we're going to go and find our local motors rally fighter. And we're going to use that. So now once actually loaded into the race event here, what we're going to go and do is go into difficulty and settings here and select your difficulty settings and then pretty much just copy down exactly what is up on the screen right here. Now essentially by doing this you guys will be getting a plus 100% difficulty bonus credits which will be pretty much maximizing your rewards from today's mind glitch. So once you have these difficulty settings all copied down we're going to go ahead and hop straight into the race here. So we're going to go ahead and hit start race event right here and then you're going to get right here and pretty much just follow my lead. So we're actually not going to go too far here. So we're going to run through the first checkpoint here, as well as the second one. So we're going to drive through the second one too. We're going to come up here to the third one, and then we're going to hang a sharp right. And then we're going to drive over to these tunnels, push in this container right here, and then, well, hang on, drive straight into the tunnel. And then just go ahead and hold your handbrake. Money and XP mode activated is going to pop up on your screen. Hold your handbrake. Your car's just going to bug out for a second, and then it'll stay planted right here. So it's continuously hold your handbrake and you're going to sit here for about 10 to 15 seconds. And then pretty much after the 10 or 15 seconds of sitting here holding your handbrake is done, you will get your rewards. And just like that, about 10 seconds later I'd say, the race event has now gone ahead and completed and now it's time to get all of our rewards. So here we go. And just like that, an easy 80,000 XP, free wheel spin at the end. We're going to win, win big right here with 250,000 credits. Not bad at all. And then just like that, there you go, 80,000 XP as well as 530,000 credits. Another free wheel spin. So just like that, pretty good rewards. Told you guys we'd get two extra wheel spins as well. And uh, we actually won pretty big on that first wheel spin. And then we did get 530,000 credits and 80,000 XP. And we did this all under a minute. So not bad at all. Now this may take longer for some, uh, depending on your loading times and stuff like that. But you're only in the glitch race event itself. I'd say about 20 seconds because it takes about 10 seconds to drive to the spot and then you're just going to sit there and hold your hand handbrake for about 10 seconds and then it'll complete and you'll get all of your rewards so honestly not bad at all so pretty much that's going to wrap it up for today's video that's it for today's mind glitch hope you guys did enjoy and find this video helpful remember if you guys did leave a like as well as subscribe turn on post notifications to stay up to date with more new videos such as this one or others similar to it and with that thank you guys so much for watching and with that catch you guys very very soon in the next one